Jeopardy! Let's meet today's contestants. I'm the blue guy from New York, New York, Blue Eminem. I'm the green dinosaur from Yoshi's Island, Green Yoshi. And it are returning champions. I lost one to Ice Flower from the Mushroom Kingdom of Super Mario Brothers, Ice Mario. Whose eight days cash winnings total three hundred five thousand three dollars. And now here is the host of Jeopardy, Alex Trebek. Thank you, Johnny. Welcome, everyone. And we have the adjuster looking for in this is our returning champion in yesterday's program. And Ice Mario is a seventh game, not the six days. All right, now we have Ice Mario, Yoshi, and Blue. Welcome aboard, Grab the scene and devices. Let's begin. Let's go to work in the Jeopardy round. One dilly double, and here are the categories: big stuff, tourist attractions, reverse, the owl, owl. That's the quotation marks. Following nicknames and cats. Ice Mario, you stars off. Cats for 200. The line of that point type of this that cat was a white body and pinkish gray markings. Ice Mario, what is the Siamese? Yes, you're correct. Cats for 400. Latin for king, it follows Cornish and Devon in the names of cat breeds. Ice Mario. Where's the Rex? Right. Cats for 600. This breed traces its ancestry back at, back to 1975 with the kitten named Epidermis. At least she's had a nose. Ice Mario. What is this? Sphinx. Correct. Cats for 1000. Cats for 800. The national cat of Russia is this type and it does meow, not bark, like a husky. Ice Mario. What is the Siberian? Correct. Cats for thousand. T.S. Eliot wrote lies to this long hair breed with a Middle Eastern name. Ice Mario. What is a Persian cat? Yes, you ran that category. Make your selection. Owl for 200. A frown of displeasure. Yoshi. What is the scowl? Yes, you won on the board. Uh, let's get to Owl for 400. Answer. <laughs> Dilly Double. I'm going to risk another $200 or the risk in $1,000. 1000 one thousand, all right. Here is your clue. This. The lower part of your cheek. What is jowl? You are right. I'm going to bring us to one thousand dollars. Go again. Now uh, let's go to Al for eight hundred. To a hood for Batman. Blue. What is a cowl? Yes, yelling under the board. Owl for 600. To roam steathily. What is prowl? Back to blue. Owl for 1000. A person who hunts wild birds for food. What is a fowler? Back to blue. Uh, let's go to reverse for 200. This type of home loan converts home equality into cash. You have to be 62 or older to qualify for the one of the FHA. Ice Mario. What is a reverse mud gauge? Correct. Reverse for 400. In 19, this basic stitch is the reverse of the Dinic stitch. Blue. Uh, what is the spoon? No. Yoshi and Mario? What is a pearl? Back to Ice Mario. Reverse to 600. 
A phrase meaning at 180 in your situation or the film with Jeremy Irons and Glenn Close as Claus and Sonny Von Below. Ice Mario. What's the reversal of fortune? He's the one. Uh, let's go to reverse for 800. It's the process in which pearl water is produced by forcing waste through a semi-permeable membrane. What is it? Reverse osmosis. Back to Mario. Reverse a thousand. A body such as Venus that moves in the opposite direction of other members of, of the solar system as this kind of motion. Blue. What is retrograde motion? Correct. And that's worth twelve hundred dollars. He's in tie in second second place. Break time when you come back. Welcome back to the moment. Well, but no, welcome back. All right, Blue is from New York, New York. All right, so Blue, you would just like that, and this time we're going to do Tells of Myself. And I'm going to just look at it for M&Ms, and this is just like it's their commercials on TV, and this is just like it's the M&Ms, and this is just like it's a Halloween, it's the M&Ms, and the haze are not spread M&Ms. Oh, Blue. You would just like that. <laughs> That's just like me. You know what? No, that's right. <laughs> right. Nice going, Blue. Thank you, Alex. You're welcome. Thank you very much. All right. Next to Yoshi. Hi. Yoshi. Yoshi. Green Yoshi is from Yoshi's Island. Okay. So, Yoshi. So, we're here just so this time. We're going to do Tells of Myself. Hey, I'm just looking for Marco Tour. It was a Halloween tour yesterday. And I can't wait for tomorrow. I'm about to see Super Mario Brothers Wonders coming out. Oh, we heard it just like that. Super Mario Brothers Wonder. <laughs> That's just like that. <laughs> right. This just like you know, this Super Mario Brothers Wonder. <laughs> this like that. <laughs> right. That's going, Yoshi. Thank you, Alex. You're welcome. Thank you very much. All right. Last is Ice Mario. All right. Ice Mario is from Super Mario Brothers. All right. So Ice Mario. You would hit just like that, and this time we're gonna do Tells Myself. And then it's just like gonna fall Mark our tour, and this is just like gonna say, Yesterday is a Halloween tour, and tomorrow they're about to see Super Mario Bros. Wonder is coming out, and this is just like gonna say, Saint the Flower Kingdom, and just stop Bowser. Oh, you hit just like gonna this, just like gonna this. And stop Bowser and save the Flower Kingdom. Alright. <laughs> Nice going, nice Mario. Thank you, Alex. You're welcome. Thank you very much. All right, all right, Blue. We haven't seen the device. You have a command at the board. Makes a selection. We have a command at the board. Has to continue right now. Uh, let's go to nicknames for 200. Some call Lewis Waterman the father of this fancy kind of pen. Ice Mario. Why is it fountain pen? Yes. Father nicknames of 400. Born over 2,000 years ago, he's the father of medicine. Blue. Who is Hippocrates? Hippocrates is correct. Following nicknames of 600. Jules Verne is known as the father of this journey of literature. Blue. What is science fiction? Correct. Nicknames for 800. This is a merchant known as the father of the dime store opened his first store in 1879. Blue. Who's Herbert Hoover? Nope. Yoshi. Who's Frank? Tell me who was. Yes. Nickname is a thousand. Born in 1912, this Englishman is no Englishman is known as the father of computer science. Blue. Who's Alan Turing? Yes. Uh, let's go to Mixed up for 200. This planet is so big that more than 1,000 Earths would fit inside it. Ice Mario. What is Pluto? No. Yoshi. What is Jupiter? You got it. 
Pick stuff for 400. This country's king fought at an airport covers 300 square miles more than all of Bahrain, which has three airports of its own. Ice Mario. What is Saudi Arabia? Correct. Pick stuff for 600. Decided it in 80 AD, it covered by Acres was four stories high and originally sat 50,000 spectators. Ice Mario. What is the Colosseum? Correct. Big stuff for 800. Cover City, Kansas claims the world's biggest ball of this fire letter item with around 8 million feet. That was a what is a sizzle twine. Back to Ice Mario. Big up a thousand. The world's largest building by volume is this company's 472 million cubic foot factory in every wash. Blue. What is Boeing? Yes. Boeing is correct. Alright, well, let's go to tourist attraction for 200. For a great view, Get to the top of this 300 meter structure local, local dead on the Champs de Mars. Ice Mario. Was the Eiffel Tower? Correct. Tourist attraction for 400. In 2016, the Wizard World is this of this character opened at Universal Studios Hollywood. Ice Mario. Who is Harry Potter? Yes. Attraction for 600. You can book your own private capsule and take a spin 443 feet above the themes on this attraction. Blue. What is the London Eye? Correct. Attraction for 800. Consider of three extinct volcanoes, it contains Africa's highest point. Blue. What is Mount Everest? Nope. Yoshi and Mario? What is Mount Kilimanjaro? That's a lost clue. This river may a city on the Yucatan Peninsula is complete with the pyramid rising 79 feet above the main plaza. Yoshi. What is Machu Picchu? Nope. Ice Mario. What is Chichen Itza? Yes, so that's worth sixty-four hundred dollars and up to Jeopardy round. Ice Mario's in the lead. Blues is in second place, and Yoshi gonna go first and double Jeopardy. We need to take a break. Welcome back to the moment. Bye after this. Welcome back. Let's go for double Jeopardy round. And here are the categories. We got a EU sorry EAU that's a quotation marks. Diners Club. Familiar phrases. Literary clergy man. Clergy man. Nine letter words. And a European geography. All right, Yoshi, you start. You sign for 400. It can mean a government, department, or a chest of drawers. What is a burrow? Burrow. Back to Yoshi. You sign for me. When something hits one of these after a period of growth, it stops a creasing. Ice Mario. What is a put you? Yes. He was selling for 1200 Answer. <laughs> Dilly Double! <laughs> Let's go to... 6400 6400 Alright, here's the clue. At the start of winter, this Alaskan capital barely gets six... half hours of daylight. What is... Janu? You are right. And to bring us to thirteen thousand two hundred dollars. Go again. You sorry for 
1600. Named for the region of Burgundy, it's a red wine drunk when it's young, the Norvio type when it's very young. What is a Bojolinus? non view. Back to Ice Mario. Sorry for 2000. It's the clothing in Linden's a bright assembles for her merry age. Blue. What is a Chasu? Yes. Uh, let's go to I'm going to go for familiar phrases for 400. Someone who, lo who looks out a zoo is said to be green around these fish organs. Yoshi. Why are the gals? You are correct. Francis Marie. When all else fails, read these. Ice Mario. Where? The direction. Yes, this is a destruction. It's a selection. Familiar phrases for 1200. The line about eating this and having it too was record. In a 1546 book by John Hay Wood. Yoshi. Where's cake? Correct. Francis is 16. Edward Bowler, Lighten wrote that is this instrument is mightier than the sword. Blue. What is the flute? No. Yoshi. Where's the pen? You got it. Francis for 10,000. This familiar French phrase translate to if you please. What is a seal boss plate? Back to Yoshi. Um, that one was a four. This mark of punctuation combines to other punctuation marks. Blue. What is the period? No. Ice Mario. What is the semicolon? Yes. Let's go to nine words for eight hundred. This fuse or Percussion cap is used to set off an explosive charge. Yoshi. What is it? Detonator. Yes. Um, nine hundred words for twelve hundred. Answer. <laughs> Yellow Dilly Double. Chidilly Double. Chidilly Double. Okay, here is a clue. The derivation in history of a word. What is entomology? That is right. And to bring us to ten thousand four hundred dollars, go again. Nine hundred words for sixteen. And computer lingo is the reduced digital image of a graphic used so that multiple image can be viewed on the page. Blue. What is a thumbnail? Yes. Uh, nine hundred words for two thousand. Latin for rise up is one who rebels against an established government. Blue. What is an esurgent? Correct. Makes a selection, Blue. Uh, let's go to European Geography for 400. It's the name of the peninsula that includes Sweden and Norway as well as the region that also includes Denmark. Ice Mario. What is Canada? Nope. Blue. What is Germany? Nope. What is Scandinavia? Back to blue. Geography for A. Kiev is the capital of this country. Ice Mario. What is Ukraine? Correct. Uh, European geography for 1200. These two rivers, one flowing through France and the other through Germany, differ by a name letter. Blue. What are the Rhone and the Rhine? Do you will write? Geography for 1600. This mountain range forms natural barrier between France and Spain. Blue. What are the Pyrenees? Yeah. Geography to 2000. This principality is located between Switzerland and Australia. Blue. What is Sydney? Nope. Yoshi and Mario? What is Lechenstein? Back to blue. Uh, let's go to Diners Club for 400. 
Sweet potatoes are packed with this red and orange pigment, a powerful axion sedent. Ice Mario. What is painted? Carantini. He's the one. Terrence Club. Read. This catch all term for spicy gravy based dish dishes of eat East it's Indian Oregon Conspondon Tamil for sauce. Blue. What is Prego? No. Yoshi. What is curry? Yes. Diamond Club for 12. Both Balk Lava and Spain Nakopta are made with tissue thin layers of this type of Greek dough. What is Philo Dough? Back to Yoshi. Diamond Club for 16. Chip of lights are the dry forms of these dark greens chili peppers. Blue. What are jalapenos? Yes. Uh, let's go to Diners Club for 2000. Jumbo gets its name from the African word for this vegetable. Blue. What are carrots? No. Ice Mario. What is okra? Yes. Let's go to Legendary Kerrigan Man, Gregory Man for 400. And it is Jane Austen novel William Collins is, is the minister who has designed Elizabeth Penn Bennett. Blue. What is Pride to produce? Yes. Uh, Legendary for 800. Father Lankenstein Marin is this title character of the 1971 William Peter Bloody book. Yoshi. What is the Exorcist? Correct. Clangery Man for 12. In this Colleen McCollinan novel, Maggie Cleary and Parish priest Ralph D. Bracarestis fall in love. Ice Mario. What is the Thornbirds? Yes. Clangery Man for 1600. Fame evangelist Billy Sunday reportedly called Singular Lewis Satin's cohort for writing this 1927 novel. Blue. What is Amar Gentry? Yes, that's the last clue. Silenius is is in a bomb monk in this Dan Brown novel. Blue. What is the Da Vinci Code? Yes, so that's for ten thousand dollars. You end up the Jeopardy round, double Jeopardy round. Excuse me. All three with you. Here comes the final Jeopardy category. Is this science tips? Please make an arrangers. Remember to get there before the clue. Right up to this. We're back to our final Jeopardy. The category is scientists. Players, here's a clue. As a humorous tribute and an astronomical, astronomical term, a event to at least four billion as being named for this astronomer. Thirty seconds. Good luck. Time is up. Now let's begin. Let's start with blue. So you have a ten thousand dollars for the rope down with spawn. Who is Emil Zola? Sorry, incorrect. And what's the rager? Everything. Lose it all. Go down to zero. Now to Yoshi. So we have a twelve thousand dollars for the rope down with spawn. Who is called Sagan? Yes! And this is just like is a what astronomer and this astronomer term equivalent. Uh, you are right. And what's your ad? Twelve thousand, you are double the twenty-four thousand dollars. Now next to Ice Mario is not gonna be happy with it. She wrote down who is called Sonkin. You know that's correct. 
And what's your ad? Eleven thousand six hundred dollars. Gonna be ad of thirty thousand dollars. That means Ice Mario. You're the Jeopardy champion. And so we got at nine days grand total is three hundred thirty-five thousand three dollars. Where do you go, Ice Mario? And once again, hope you're playing a game tomorrow. Thank you for joining us here. So long, everyone.